Hey. Hey, Jessica. Welcome to my FM. Well, thank you very much. So how thank has... Thank you for having me, yeah. considering the circumstances. Yes, of course, eh? So how has your life been since Survivor wrapped up? Oh, my goodness. It, it's been a whirlwind. I mean, Survivor has actually been a part of our lives as a family for 10 years, mm-hmm. but to now have it be about me and being noticed in public and and some of those little presents that you end up with in a Survivor and living in the in the jungles, like parasites and things, you know, things you got to <laughs> deal with. It's all worth it. It's It's been amazing. It's been amazing. I'm so grateful to have the experience. Yes, absolutely. It must be nice walking down the street with Rupert and people are looking at you. He's like, no, they're looking at me, Rupert, not you. <laughs> it's my turn. <laughs> well, I'm kind of a shy person, so, you know, I enjoy that, that we're... You know, the good people, not the Russell Hanses, mm-hmm. you know, some of these other people, Johnny Fairplay that has played the game that people do not like. Yes. So it's good to be Rupert's wife, and it's good to be, you know, someone who sticks to my who I am in the game. Mm-hmm. So. Good. So, Laura, let's go back to the very first day on the island. You're picked on right away, and your original tribe voted you out. How was that for a first impression on the new players? Um, it was tough because I tried not to take it personally. I really, you know, I'm thinking I'm the old woman. Oh, my gosh. You know, I'm 45. I was 44 when I was playing the game. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, my gosh, it's because I'm the old woman and they think I'm out of shape? Or what is this? And yeah. it's clearly, you know, the, the blood versus water adds that whole dimension of the game where they were obviously trying to weaken Rupert's game yes. is, is, you know, I think what happened. Mm-hmm. And then Rupert but did we'll, we'll step stick in. We'll with that. Yeah, we'll <laughs> stick with that. So <laughs> Rupert did step in to switch bots with you. Did that surprise you that he did that? Um, yes and no. Um, the whole, I mean, I was actually really in shock the whole first part of that game because I could not even believe that they would put us through all this and, you know, to have such an opportunity and then have someone be voted out. Mm-hmm. Like, that's so evil. So it's cruel. terrible. Yeah. So I was in complete shock anyway. And then... When they said Redemption Island, he saw, like, the, oh, my God, in my face. (laughs) Like, I don't want to do, you know, oh, my gosh, this is happening. Mm -hmm. So he immediately clicked into, okay, you know, she's never played before. This is my fourth time. I can, you know, I can let her do this. He has a chance to get back in the game. So So let's admit, though, you had some tough shoes to fill, considering your husband, Rupert, is a very well-known. Did that intimidate you in any way heading into the game? Um, Actually, when I got into the game... It was intimidating because I had that pressure put on me. They were expecting Rupert to come and build the shelter and, you know, provide fish for them. So, yes, I was intimidated when I got into the game because I had that pressure to perform like Rupert, Mm -hmm. and I was not. So, I actually, I wish they would have shown good old editing. You know, I, I, you know, they're showing me a fumbling, you know, newbie at the beginning, and I was cracking those, you know, coconuts open like a champ by the end, and that took a lot of energy. And I was using the Hawaiian sling and fishing. So, you know, I could do all those things. They just, of course, unfortunately never showed that. Mm -hmm. Now, I know you already (laughs) mentioned this, but uh, we did see you as a quiet person, but it didn't take you long to break out of your shell. So how much did Survivor change you in a good way? Um, It really just gave me so much more confidence. I mean, I'm just kind of, you know, I'm not always sure of myself. I'm kind of awkward, you know. And so it just made me feel better about myself being out there in public and just, Just being, you know, Rupert and I being the good people of the game, not the bad guys. You know, it just feels good to have have people, you know, say, we like how you played the game. It's okay. You know, Mm -hmm. it's not always about the million bucks. It's, you know, the gift you get from the game and from each other, you know, hopefully being able to play together. Yeah. So how about the game itself? When you watch back now, what did you see as your biggest mistake? Uh, Definitely telling telling Vita. Um, you know, <laughs> I say at the beginning, I'm not going to make these emotional decisions, and what do I do? You know, we had talked to each other before that, obviously, and said, you know, hey, out of respect, you know, let me know if they're talking about writing my name down, yeah. I'll do the same for you. Yeah. Well, you know, and if our alliance of girls would have been strong enough, it shouldn't have mattered, really, mm-hmm. you know, telling him that he's going home, if we all, you know, openly agreed. But obviously, there was already some plan, you know, other alliance. To, to get me out, so and it was just an extra excuse, I think, for the girls to to yeah. get me out of the game. And it kind of it was kind of hard to watch because you were just telling him that out of respect for him, so he could be prepared. Right, being being trustworthy had nothing to do with yeah. any of you know, uh, you know, if anything, he didn't trust. I didn't, you know, they missed my trust and you know got rid of me and didn't tell me. So yeah. Yeah. it's just a crazy game, and you know, it's 
nice doesn't win Survivor, but, you know, I feel I can walk the streets and hold my head high and know I made a decision because of who I am, not because I'm um, some jerk, you know. There we go. So, Rupert, he's yeah. played a few times. Is there a chance that we'd ever see you back on Survivor? You know, it's crazy. I, I've, I've done the game, and I've got the bug. I would do it again. It was a great adventure. It's a lot of fun. I mean, who knows where in the world you would go again, and, you know, if they were to do something again. You know, of course, Rupert would do it again, too, in a heartbeat, because he still has not technically won the game. <laughs> so, yeah. oh, yeah. You know, I don't know that they do or we re. re you know, redo of this, but I, I would be for another survivor. Well, well hopefully I we'll would. see you again sometime in the future. All right. And thanks so much for joining me today on my FM. Well, thank you so much, Jessica. Have a great day. You too. Bye-bye. Bye.